What's up, what's up? Back at it again with another reaction video. This is another Conservative Twins, aka the Haas Twins. This is another one. Um, basically up in, uh, what, what's that one guy's name again? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, Ron, Ron DeSantis, Santis, um, Science Builder for Tech Woman Sports. <laughs> Interesting. Like I always say, keep your mind open to two sides of the story instead of one. Um, I forgot the, the rest of the scene, but I'm going to get straight into this. So, yeah, original link for this will be down below. Show a huge appreciation to my like, comment, subscribe, and sharing all that positive energy. You deserve. Yeah. We got a new show for y'all. Got a damn good show. Yeah. Before it starts show, you can always support the twins. Where? Hogs you tell twins. them, Keith. <laughs> OfficialHogsTwins.com. Say it like you mean it. OfficialHogsTwins.com. There you go. Uh -huh. Tell them how much you get off, man. Give them the discount code. Man. <laughs> tell them the discount code. Stop ordering me around and you tell them. Discount code is Chinese virus. Get 20% off. Yeah. Tell them what they can get at OfficialHogsTwins.com. Patriotic t-shirts, hats. We even sell them white privilege cards. <laughs> and don't forget about my beard product. Look at it hanging. Your action over here. Yeah. All right, Kevin. <laughs> I even put it in my heart. Look at my bangs. Oh, goofy. They're coming in. <laughs> Look at the duck tail. That's a whole bird oil right there, baby. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> Yo, low key. Uh, not to be off subject, I like the mic they're using. I know a lot of people who do podcasts basically anything you can think of they use mics like those and i love that type of shit because it sounds freaking professional i ain't gonna lie to you yeah we even go into texas in november like .com. all right let's though. get to and to indianapolis we're sorry but the uh the gate people got us they say we can't come out all right look i'm over it look here um jesus christ man governor DeSantis, man that is america's governor right there he's not a rising star He's a star <laughs> in the Republican Party. Yeah. He's a damn good man. <laughs> He's a damn good governor. Governor. I governor. think governor. <laughs> <laughs> got to pick yeah. the V in there. You got to put that little draw in there. That's something. Yeah, that's a and damn. I know a lot of people have um, other, other decisions like, oh, this ain't right. Why is he doing this type of stuff but man look i'm gonna keep it 100 with you there should be three types of sports right for different genders but yet it it comes to a point where like oh you're offensive i'm like am i really come on man like look we got male sport right we got female sports let's make a third one individually yourself having it be like i you know, me even thinking about it, it, it still becomes a controversial s subject. Like, hey, we have a man sport, we have a woman sport, we have a transgender sport. But people don't like that. They, <laughs> you know, it, it, you know, sometimes it's hard to really put ideas out there because you end up just being criticized. But at the same time, man, look, you, you're a freaking alpha, or you're a queen, or you're, you're a king. Like, say what you gotta say, man. Say it from your heart, you know what I'm saying? I'm good governor. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, can y'all believe? I think I'm looking at the future president of these United States. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, we'll um, see. Trump, I think he wants it back. <laughs> he wants the title back. I mm -hmm. didn't say when he's going to be president. All I'm saying is, y'all looking at one of the future presidents of this great nation. Yeah. President DeSantis. All right, let me say this. King got a nice ring to it. Sound like it's going to be two terms, too. Mm. Eight years. Mm. <laughs> and you know what's Look crazy? Face. <laughs> he barely beat that black guy he was running against. That's what I was trying to say for last minute. <laughs> what's don't his name? Me. I don't know. He's a, he's a scumbag. What's that dude's name? Andrew uh, Gilliam. You know that dude uh, that found, they found him passed out and vomit and puke when he was having that damn... He was a uh, gay orgy in that <laughs> hotel. Wow. Yeah. That piece of crap almost beat him. Hold on, I got to pause it real quick. Not because he's gay. 
He's garbage. Yeah. I mean, I'm I have not, nothing against him in his um, sexual orientation, but he's married with kids. He shouldn't be in there with a bunch of gay strippers doing drugs. <laughs> and puking all over himself and busting nuts. Yeah. It's has just not, a, it's my, 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 tr- my dislike for this man has nothing about his sexual orientation. If he want to suck some mushroom tip, it's his, it's, his, it's his business. None of mine. I don't care about that. Yeah, I just don't. I, don't I like it. I like it. <laughs> I don't know. Um, yo, look. I like what what they're saying. You know what I'm saying? Like, it doesn't matter which gender you are. But it's the way that it's being pushed. That's the thing. That that worries me a lot. Like you're you're over pushing your boundaries. You know what I'm saying? I'm just gonna keep it at that. I just think he's uh he lacks integrity. Is what we're saying. He's a scumbag, right? Um, that scumbag could have gotten away of one of the greatest governors <laughs> Florida's ever seen. DeSantis only won by like a little bit over thirty some thousand votes. How's that happen? Probably think. People don't think. People think with their skin color. It has to come to somebody signing the bill. This but, is common sense, really. Yeah, it should be, but this would he check him out. In Florida, we're gonna do what's right. We'll stand up to corporations. They are not gonna dictate the policies in this state. We will stand up to groups like the NCAA who think that they should be able to dictate the policies in different states. Not here, not ever. Yeah. You tell them. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about right there, baby. And Look so, at uh, yeah. we won't be cowed. Yes, that'll, that'll literally be them in the crowd. <laughs> we will stand strong. And here's the thing. At the end of the day, if the price of providing opportunities that can last a lifetime for all the girls throughout the state of Florida, for ensuring fair competition for them, if the price of that is that we lose an event or two, you know, I would choose to protect our young girls every day of the week and twice on Sunday. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. That's right. That's a damn good man right there. That's a damn, That's good, damn good man. Damn good man right there, man. So we, y'all see the sweet little girls in the back? Yeah, he's protecting them. You see the little white girl biting her nails? She's like, I hope them black <laughs> transgenders don't come down here and start beating the hell out of all of us. <laughs> Did you see him? <clears throat> I was gonna Who's biting the nails, standing behind the governor, give a speech? Yeah, that she, girl nervous. She nervous as she's like, yeah, I hear you talking to Santos, but when I'm racing, who can protect me? <laughs> you gonna be there watching this? I mean, they I think it's pathetic up, that you have, well, that's the, that's the world we live in today. You yeah. actually got to come up with a bill to say men cannot race women. <laughs> it's Santa's, man. I'm telling you. It's a damn good man. Damn star. It's a damn star is what he is. <laughs> He's a damn <laughs> superstar. Got that clean cut look. Yeah, he looked like a damn president. He looked like a damn two-term president to me, man. man. He's just too damn sharp. <laughs> <laughs> hey, and another thing, man. What I was about to say, man. Hey, um, uh, skip my mind. This man, um, DeSantis is doing such a great job. I'm thinking about moving to Florida. Yeah, I'm thinking about packing all my shit, get the kids, get them with them damn wagons with a horse, and take my, <laughs> take my ass to Florida. <laughs> Just like they used to do back in the old days. Get the damn wagon, get a horse. <laughs> we go to Florida. <laughs> We going to freedom. <laughs> we going to freedom. Hey, uh, okay, we got it from you know the common sense side. Let's listen to the other side that yeah. doesn't the, doesn't really like this. The transgender. Oh, <laughs> oh man, I'm just waiting. Side <laughs> of this. Um, man, I'm just a regular girl crazy. living my best life. You know, or trying to live my best life. Um, what happened? <laughs> she gonna long jump her head. <laughs> God, God oh. dog, you see that? <laughs> you long jump in the hurdles, man. That's damn good form on the <laughs> Where?
<sighs> actions speak louder than words. Let my actions speak over my words, bro. <sighs> okay, let's continue. Is everybody else there? By the media, I'm being bashed <laughs> by um, all the conservatives, I guess you can say. And I honestly don't even consider myself as trans. I just consider myself as a female. What? And it's unfair <laughs> because that's. Yo, stop. The um, the scientific definition. Scientific. Describes <laughs> what or who I am is a trans female, but. Internally and in myself, I knew that I'm. I know that I'm a female. Just contradict I yourself. I'm a straight <laughs> female, so a transgender <laughs> female who is heterosexual, who likes. Man, cut this girl off. <laughs> um, you a straight a female <laughs> and you're a heterosexual. <laughs> hey, look here, girl. Words matter. <laughs> <laughs> All lives funny. matter. Black lives <laughs> matter. But words matter even more. You're not heterosexual. That's something straight people say. Yeah. You're, You're a gay man living your life as a woman. Yeah, you like... Which I'm cool with. You like anal, you know what. Look, I'm cool with that. I'm cool, I'm cool with you living your best life. I'm cool with that too. Yeah. I'm not transphobic or, you know, but come on, man. You got to have a little integrity. You have a huge advantage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A huge advantage. I mean, that upset me greatly just looking at you just destroy those white girls it's like I f yo i was to be honest i was not gonna say anything about that scene but something like literally came out my damn my energy my spirit it was like bro you're gonna talk about this you're gonna say something you're gonna add your two cent into this like literally i was gonna i was gonna close my mouth man i didn't i don't want to say anything but that shit just got me like oh man you know what i mean damn uh, now I know what Hitler felt like when he seen Jesse Owens blowing out them white supremacists in that damn, what was it, Olympics? <laughs> I know, now I know what he felt like. Them white supremacists didn't have a chance. <laughs> them little girls you racing against, Don't they have didn't have a chance, man. Not a chance at all. Look here. Look here, man. God all damn. lives matter, black lives matter, words matter. Yeah. You cannot walk around here Talking claiming about you heterosexual. <laughs> I guarantee you, look, there's a Gender was always based on science. I don't know what science book you read, <laughs> but men have a penis. Mushroom and, tip, man. Right, and women have a gash. <laughs> I guarantee I you, did. you ain't got no gash yeah. between your legs. Yeah, you would never you would never have experienced child labor. You would never go through menopause. You would never have a menstrual cycle. Until you do, you will never be a female. Until yeah. science can do that for you, you are not a female. And I, I think if science, do, if somebody, if somebody is able to do that, I'm thinking he's a mad scientist. Yeah, it, they're never going to come out with that. They banned stem cells. Uh, mm, never say never. Trust me on that. Never say never. That's all I got to say. Yeah. They banning stem, stem cells can save lives, change people's lives. They banned yeah. that because he said it's playing on God. God's. I yeah. know they'll never let yeah. CC here. That's, yeah. that's, her, that's her name? Yeah, CC. Look here, CC. I'm, I'm, I'm really pulling for you. I'm happy that you're living your best life. Yeah, I'm no problem with that. I have no problem with I you. I believe being, in the Constitution. Yeah. I believe in freedom. But you got I believe you have the right to live your, your life. Have you? But yeah. racing biological women i don't know why i have to say biological yeah genesis was always based on biology yeah and i already just explained that gash penis not what it's not it's not up science, here your gender is not up here it's down there now, now you might think you're a female and you want to you, live your life as a female and i totally uh, in agreement with that if you want to live your life as a female because i do believe in the constitution i do believe in free yeah i believe you should just race other transgender women like yourself yeah. or men Right. That's didn't I just say, well yeah, but then did I just say that? Like literally, we should have three types oh my gosh. We should have three types of categories. We got males, we got females, then we got transgender. Am I am I a genius? Well it was kinda obvious, like you know. <laughs> but <laughs> how sports has always been Yeah. 
built. Yeah. Men compete against men biologically. Yeah. Look, life, women against women. Not yeah. create your own sport. Look, life is not fair. Life will never be fair. You may feel that you're a female, and I don't know what you people are going through. Yeah. But and it should just literally be two categories of transgender groups. Like a man turn into a female have their type of sport, then a female turn into a man have their type of sport too. So it'll be individually separated from those two um those the, the, those genders, you know what I'm saying? Like we have like four category groups. We have a male group, we got a female group for sports, we got a male male who turned into a female group, and we have a female who turned into a male group. All separate uh playing sports. You know what I'm saying? Or anything else pretty much. But you know that's unfair that you find yourself in that position. I can sympathize with you. But on the other hand, you have to sympathize with females that you're running against. They've training, they're training just as hard as you are, if not harder, and then they go to a race and they have absolutely no opportunity to win because you have a a huge competitive advantage against them. Yeah, you mm -hmm. you have to be the bigger person. It, you look like an uh, adult racing uh, kids. Yeah, it's like just you, when you I think people look, you'll never see <coughs> women yeah. transitioning into men and dominating men's sports mm -hmm. because biologically you're not as superior as the male physique. You're not as strong. Dominance. Yeah, it's I mean, I think we all should be treated equally in the eyes of the law, but physically there are significant differences. Yeah. And you can't pass no And at the same time, like you you're still a goddess like you're still a queen i mean like i have nothing against that stuff man it's just the way that they're pushing it no law to make us equal the same it's just when it comes to racing when it comes to sports we always yeah. let the boys play with the boys and the girls play with the girls yeah it's like i don't know how y'all can make this argument that it's fair for you to rate uh, to <laughs> compete against women it's not fair at all. it's like it's like common sense yeah. i mean that's why you'll never see women dominate men's sports because yeah. it's not fair Let's i just, don't care how much steroids the woman take yeah she will not be on the level of men ever yeah i mean just just look at it from a human's perspective a human yeah just be human be a real person Life's unfair. You find yourself in a a position that, you know, I'm never going to be able to experience or know what you're going through. Just sympathize with, with the females, what they're going through. They're trying to compete and win a race, and they got some biological dude that thinks he's a female now. That's living his life as a female. Trying to win a race. That's not fair either. Ne neither one of them's fair, but you can't say shit rolls downhill. <laughs> you can't do that. I can't imagine being a female going to a race and see you standing there with a smile on your face. True nigga shit. Up to a race and I'm a guy and I see a female that's transitioning to it. I'm a smoker ass. I say, hey, 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 you finna get smoked? Yeah. You gonna smoke somebody now? Huh? I can't smoke nothing right now. I can't smoke nothing. I can barely get out my chair. Barely get out of bed and it won't take me 15 <laughs> minutes to warm up. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> Give me some stem cells. I remember I was on the track team. I was slow. Yeah. Right? And the fast guys, I did the long jump and triple jump and all that. I could jump, but I was slow. I raced the fastest girl on the uh on the female <laughs> side, blew her ass out. <laughs> 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 Mm. I could compete. I did the high jump, triple jump. I, I could. She was the fastest could, girl. Shut up. Let me do some talking. <laughs> I would spot the girl a foot. Say, hey, you jump. I give you a foot. Whatever you jump, I'm going to add 12 inches. You still can't beat me. Damn. It's just we have a significant advantage over females. man. Nothing's ever going to do away with that. Yeah, you should, you should compete against other transgender females as yeah. yourself yeah. or men. Yeah. Nobody's saying you can't compete. Yeah. You just got to compete against your biological sex because it makes things more fair. Be the bigger person here. <laughs> <laughs> literally. You are literally the biggest, strongest person whenever you get on the track, whenever you're competing against a female. Be the bigger person.
Well, really, I, I'm giving you too much credit. You're not actually being a bigger person. I'm just you're doing what's right. Yeah, you should know. Nah, man, fuck you. <laughs> talk to a damn brick wall. Man, I feel they pain. It was damn. Show. Yeah. Man, I feel they pain because the stuff they really want to say, they can't say it at all, man. Like, there's stuff I want to say too, but I can't say it. Huh. Anyways, man, show the Hosh Twins huge appreciation by like, comment, subscribing, and sharing all the positive energy. We're like Goku with the spear bomb, throwing it at the haters' face, also the nature's face. I was thinking about two sides of the stories instead of one. Don't be sleep. Be tapped in with your mind. I right, peace out.